everyone. My name is Sherilyn, and I am presenting about saving the authors. There are 13 different types of authors in the world, and here are some of them. There is giant river author, African colors author, river author, European author, Asian small coral author, and sea otter. What are otters? Otters are carnivorous mammals. They eat clams, sometimes fish and birds, and other marine invertebrates. Their scientific name is Lutrinae, and the most endangered type of otter is the hairy nose otter, and the scientific name for it is Lutra sumatrana. Otters live in many different varieties of bodies of water. Examples are freshwater rivers, lakes, and oceans. Here are some fun facts about otters. Otters have a pouch on your body where they can keep your favorite rock, among other things. Their fur is thick enough to ensure that water doesn't touch your skin so they can keep warm. Sea otters have wet feet and water repellent fur to keep them dry and warm. Happy fact! Otters hold hands while sleeping so they don't drift away and they look adorable. More characteristics of otters. Hearing. All otters have very good hearing. Some scientists believe that an otter's sense of hearing is more important than smell when for sensing danger. Sight. Eyesight is probably the most important sense for hunting. A specialized lens and cornea correct for the refraction of light caused by the transition from aerial to aquatic vision. Tactile. Clawless otters and sea otters have very sensitive forepaws. And otters of vibrissae are very sensitive to tactile stimulation and to underwater vibration. Taste. Otters show preference for certain foods, but researchers don't know if taste is important in this preference or not. And lastly, smell. Otters have an acute sense of smell. It's probably the most important sense for communication about ter territories and other things. Here's the anatomy of an otter, sea otter. They have long tails, white web feet, small forepaws, cream colored face, closable ears to keep the water out, sleek body with, and sleek body with dark brown fur. Why are otters so important? Otters are top predators sometimes, like in this photo where the giant cow is eaten by a sea urchin and the sea urchin is eaten by the sea otter. So otters are critical in maintaining the balance of near shore ecosystems such as kelp forests. Without sea otters, the sea urchin can overpopulate and they will eat the and then they'll eat the giant kelp, which will not only destroy the giant kelp forest and all the, the and it'll also get rid of cover for other local animals and also the other animals will no longer be safe. It also protects coastlines from storm surge and absorbs large amounts of harmful carbon dioxide from the atmosphere. The other animals they eat, besides sea urchins, will overpopulate, and if they eat any plants or other animals, those animals will be endangered and extinct, which will ruin the ecosystem and economy. Others are recognized as being keystone species whose position in food chains is important in maintaining the ecological health of an area. They not only ensure the health of the kelp forest, but also many local species. What is happening to the otters? Many are dying drastically and the numbers are decreasing. Historically, sea otters are numbered to be around 150,000 and 300,000 animals throughout the Pacific Rim. The southern sea otter population, which was once numbered about 16,000 animals, is now hovering around 3,000 today. Also, today, there are estimated to be just over 106,000 worldwide. These numbers may sound big, but they're actually quite small compared to last time. They are extinct, endangered, and if nothing shall be done, they could become extinct. Did you know, otters are keystone species, like I have said before, meaning their role makes a greater impact than other animals, so we have to help them. Otters are endangered because oil spills and leakages. When oil spills into the sea, they there's It'll, and it gets on their skin. It'll, their skin, their fur will lose the um the ability to stay warm, which will and unlike other animals who can just wipe it off, otters depend on the ability to stay their fur staying 
dry in order to stay warm. They will die from hypothermia, and if that doesn't kill them first, the oil will kill them. Sea otters were hunted for their luxurious pelts, or otherwise known as fur. Their numbers started to decrease significantly, and once the hunting stopped for a while, it, it, it became to incline again. However, humans started killing otters even more with gillnets and trammel fisheries. Gillnets and trammel fisheries were made for, to catch a large fish, but let the smaller fish go free. However, if an otter gets stuck in it, they can die from trauma, uh, from starvation, and other things. Increase in mortality in adults make the numbers decline even more, which caused the, which, and although it stopped a bit, it is still making the numbers decline. Fishermen killed otters because they thought there were competition in getting fish because otters are known for eating larger amounts of fish. People hunted the otter's natural prey or destroyed the prey's habitat, which allowed the otter not to have any food. Water pollution also caused the otter to lose home and, like I said earlier, have, they will destroy themselves by it. And loss of habitat will have the otter not having a home anymore and allowing them to be um, easily detected. How can we help? The three R's, reduce, reuse, and recycle. Do not pollute or litter. Try to make sure areas near you that otters live in are in great condition. Dispose and get rid of hazardous waste product. Grow a garden. Use non-toxic household cleaning products. Purchase sustainable, recyclable, biodegradable goods. Volunteer to help, maybe at a beach or where otter lives, and learn more about the ocean's issues and share your knowledge with others so they can see how important we need to help with. Thank you for listening. Please help the otters. They are extremely dangerous and if nothing shall be done, they'll be gone for this world in this world forever. They will be important for other generations to see. Thank you. Thank you.